We are looking at a concierge class, Category D suite, here on board the brand new Regent 7C Splendor. And we now have touch locks on Regent. And if you want to just have the lights on all the time and not have to worry about your card, you can just put another card in there. And by the way, hi guys, I'm Mike. Welcome to Affluent Journeys. That's my website, affluentjourneys.com. We got a couple of coat hangers back here. No high technology for the privacy system. You just use one of those. And we have a lighted room temperature system here. I'll put that down a degree or two. But they don't say exactly what temperature you're putting it. Then uh, we'll look in the bathroom here. We've got a full length mirror. And if it's in the budget for you to upgrade to concierge over the regular rooms, I recommend it. Uh, look at the Great marble bathroom here with a full-size tub. No rainfall head in the concierge, but we do have a removable shower head. Double marble sinks, chrome fixtures. This is a little toothbrush cup that they build in there. And really nice high-quality L'Occitane uh, amenities. I found the perfumes to be a little strong. So what they do have... And I asked for the unscented, you know, hypoallergenic type here. So that's on request if you want that. Little amenity kits, shower caps, single head. I got a phone right by the toilet. And then we have a nice separate sliding door here. And then you'll have the high quality grow rainfall head. Big removable head here with multiple settings on it. A little shelf in there to put stuff. And I learned recently that's for shaving your legs. Someone on another video gave me a good comment about it. So another big mirror here. Make sure you look good before you go out. And we have a big walk-in closet. So we'll have a safe here, hair dryer, shoehorn, sewing kit. Concierge gets free valet laundry, and there's also free laundry on Regent. I think they have three or four laundrettes throughout the ship. I'll show that on my full video tour, which I will have here of the brand new 7C Splendor. Uh, different types of hangers here, two robes, and more hangers in the back. A tote bag they give you. Life jackets are here up top. And cashmere blankets for concierge level guests and above. A little blanket up here. So tons of storage, nice marble, and this is real marble, by the way. So they spend a lot of money on the look and feel and fit and finish. And they just announced uh, today, right when I got on board, no more masks on Regent. So you can put that one away. And here we have the passages. This is the daily calendar on board cruise. You can see this is our... Schedule here will be in Costa Maya after a day at sea. And they give you the basic information that you want to know, the schedule of things to do on board, more information about the lounges and dining. You'll see more about that on my full tour video, entertainment. They do have a full entertainment program on board Regent, culinary arts as well. And then they give a shore excursion book, got a welcome letter, dinner reservations will be in Prime 7 tomorrow night. And the social host just invited me to the cocktail hour. And Regent has nice new card wallets now, and they don't smell as much as the old ones did that were really rubbery. They give you a little deck plan in there also. And directions how to get on the internet. Phone here. So then we do have curtain separation in the concierge. That's important. And welcome Heidsick Monopole Champagne, really high quality. And these are real live orchids. And we'll have a little kind of love seat here with reading lights. Oh, there we go. Just pull it out. 
have your uh, main buffet table that they give you, uh, Samsung flat screen TVs, and they do swing out. And it's not like a high quality system here, but basically it swings out and then the pin will lock into place. So it only goes about 45 degrees or so. And then you'll have to undo the pin and slide it back. Each room has its own Wi-Fi router. You also get binoculars for use and they have the Illy little espresso machine. And they'll have a mini bar down here. All of this is included at Heineken's. In our region, all the drinks are included primarily, unless you want a real expensive wine or whatnot. Just more storage space here. And this is the Royal Elite uh, King Slumber Bed. They got a fancy name for it, and it does split off into two twins. And what they do is they put one of the nightstands in between to give you some separation. Yeah, so this is really cool. Nice wood and linen. More reading lights here that are adjustable and a tufted headboard. More pillows than I can use. And then they will have on each side uh, American ports and two USBs. And then over on the desk they'll have the international ports there. And this is a cell phone that you can take with you around the cruise ship. Uh, it's very useful, especially if you have butler service. Uh, you can call your butler from anywhere on the ship and they'll bring you a drink or whatever you want to do. And then here's the TV channels that they have. A good variety. They have CNBC and Fox and international news. And they have a huge remote control. Most cruise ships have a cheap little piece of junk. And we got Kramer on right now. So let's have a look outside. This is going to be one of the best benefits of booking concierge. So we'll have two little side window here. Give you a different view of the room here. And now we'll go outside. Put it out. And this is the great benefit here. It is a huge balcony. It's a little bit dark. Hopefully you can still see it. But it's a really wide balcony. It's about four and a half steps for me to get out there. And you'll have a lounger chair and then two padded chairs with a big table. You can have breakfast out here, order it from room service and that kind of thing. And sorry about the wind, but I am using my uh, Wind Muffy mic. And the colors are gorgeous. We're just after uh, sunset. And we just left uh, Port Miami a little bit ago. Let's finish inside. I think it'll be better for the light. I hope you enjoyed seeing my room tour here on board the Seven Seas Splendor. Oh, by the way, I forgot to tell you, this is my 50th cruise, doing it right here in style on Regent. So I uh, hope you enjoyed the video. If so, make sure to hit like if you haven't already. Subscribe to Affluent Journeys. That helps me a lot. Follow Affluent Journeys on Facebook. I put all my special deals and exclusive offers, especially those on Regent, there. So it's a great way to save money and stack up the benefits on your next Regent cruise. And speaking of that... In most cases, I can improve the offer that you would have by booking direct with the cruise lines on your own. So if you're seriously interested in booking a cruise here, perhaps on Regent, uh, they have all kinds of cruises all around the world, and including World Cruises, which is coming up soon, uh, make sure to give me a contact at the phone number down below, uh, or you can submit your inquiry on the website, affluentjourneys.com. And one more thing, even if you've already booked that cruise uh, recently and directly with Regent's North American offices only, uh, you're not paid in full, and you didn't go through another travel agent, I might still be able to improve that offer for you, and I'll be glad to do it. So if that's the case for you, I'll be glad to hear from you. And that's pretty much it for this one. So thanks again for watching. hope you enjoyed it. And please stay tuned for the next one.